So we've got some news regarding NVIDIA's next generation architecture and also some news on graphics card prices. Okay, so the first thing that I really wanted to talk about is graphics card prices. They're actually starting to come down a lot. Now, if you've been following graphics card prices over about the past year, you'll notice that graphics card prices really shot up starting at around June of last year, and they got really bad at the beginning of this year, but they're actually starting to come down. For example, the GTX 1060 used to go for about $500 to $600, and now it's starting to come down to about the $300 range. Now, that's not exactly great as those cards launched at around $250 to $300, but it's definitely coming down a lot and it's starting to get around the MSRP. Other cards though, such as the 1080 Ti, are starting to come down to about $1,000 from where they were selling at about $1,200 before. Now, other graphics cards like the 1080 Ti and the 3GB 1060 really aren't seeing that much of a difference. The 1050 Ti is still selling for about $200 to $250, which isn't great, but it's definitely a lot better than what it was about a month and a half ago. So if you're starting to spec out a build, right now actually might be a good time as graphics card prices are finally starting to go down. Now the other thing I wanted to mention is that if you're buying directly from NVIDIA's website, all of their cards are completely out of stock. Which a lot of other cards have been out of stock in a lot of different places, but this is coming straight from NVIDIA, which is a little bit concerning. So in other news, new rumors are suggesting that NVIDIA's 20 series cards are actually going to be called the 11 series cards. And there's been a little bit of controversy surrounding the Volta architecture because in scientific research, these cards are actually providing extraordinarily miscalculated results. Like they're not even close, like they're just completely off, and that's because of a memory issue. Now after that controversy broke, I'm not really too bummed out that the Volta cards won't be coming. This new Ampere architecture and the Turing architecture generally are a little interesting. Now NVIDIA is rumored to start talking about the new 11 series cards in April with the GTX 1180 and the rumor GTX 1185. Now, if you know anything about NVIDIA, they've released cards ending in a five, but usually those are step down cards or they're for OEM manufacturers. For example, the GTX 265, which isn't exactly a great card, but it was for OEM manufacturers. So I think that's gonna be all guys today. There's really not that much news going on lately besides the graphics card prices and the new NVIDIA cards. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and or subscribe. And if you wanna see more of this kind of stuff and stay up to date on all the latest tech news, don't forget to click here for more videos. So thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.